thank you so much for your company this morning. The award-winning Ellie Harper is back on tour with her latest highly acclaimed production, Songs for Nobodies. Ellie plays a total of 10 roles in this showstopper, including five legendary divas, Judy Garland, Patsy Cline, Edith Piaf, Billie Holiday and Maria Callas. It is our pleasure to welcome you back to the cafe, Ali Harper, welcome. Thank you, thank you very much. Lovely to be here. Really nice to have you here. Now we had you on the show last year to promote a Doris Day special. Uh -huh. um, so you obviously enjoy playing singing legends? Well, wow, there's so much to talk about and celebrate these women. I mean, they're women of a time where, you know, you didn't need to have as many Twitter followers or Instagram <laughs> followers. It was about pure talent. And so if you're going from Doris to all these five brunettes. It's amazing I have to wear a brown wig because all these women are brunettes. Wow. And um, it's an interesting piece. I didn't write this one. A wonderful Australian playwright wrote this, Joanna Murray-Smith. And I've toured another one of her one-woman shows before. And um, I play five nobodies who each have an encounter with a somebody. And those somebodies are those women you just listed. And it's quite lovely because those nobodies are everyday women just like us who have day-to-day -day jobs, and all of a sudden, <gasps> in walks Judy Gold. <laughs> and it's like, who is your idol? Who would you like to walk in this room, and who would you just, oh my gosh. And so these women are just touched by these incredible people. And it's beautiful, it's, it's a really wonderful piece to play. You talk about it being about raw talent for a lot of these fabulous divas. Mm. You've got that. When uh -huh. did it, that all kick off for you? Oh, golly. Well, I've wanted to do what I do since I was a little girl. I just seemed to know what I wanted to do. But I have to say, getting older is quite delicious in this job. Because like those five women, they wear their heart on their sleeve. They don't care what they look like. They just tell the story and they stand there warts and all. And I have to say, this is a very coming of age kind of piece and that I can just stand there and I can be Billie Holiday and she is fluid is pumping through her body the heroin you know she's broken so everything kind of just drops and you just don't care anymore and then Maria Callas that beautiful opera singer and all of them had really tragic lives mm. so they do have scars but that makes them who they are telling th those stories through those songs you know when I sing Edith Piaf I mean we know singing her singing in French is just so incredible so are you channeling these women mm. or you know, so you're not mm. obviously mimicking them, you're actually being them. I have to be them and I suppose one of the pressures that was off me in rehearsals, Ross Gumbly, my wonderful director, said to me, you know what, we're not impersonating, we're creating their flavour, the flavour of these women and I love researching when I do a show and so I read everything I could on these women. You just need to read about Harlem and that terrible time of the lynching mm -hmm. and all that time to really get the feel of, of who Billie Holiday is and Judy Garland we know about her, you know she died of a drug overdose So mm -hmm. and the men that abuse these women as well. So I just take on that and then somehow yeah, they just come through me. It's quite organic and I just have to trust. And I know you find those little things that work for each character. Um, people talk about the vocal fry that comes mm. with oh, yeah. Billie oh, Holiday. That, that sound, yeah. Is she the most challenging? Who is the most mm. challenging for you? <laughs> Maria Callas, yeah. right at the end of the show. So I've just played Arla McDonough, who's this lovely girl working on the Anassas ship as the nanny. So I do lots of accents and it's very interesting. I really love the accents. And then all of a sudden I have to go, Visidarte. I'm not going to sing it right now because it just is a big sound and I have to be operatic. But people come and so far on my tour of New Zealand, they're really touched and I find when I go out into the floor and talk to the audience, they're really moved because these women take, the, these characters take them to a place of nostalgia and remembering how beautiful they were and how they should never be forgotten. And that really is such an honour. This yeah. piece is, an, is a beautiful honour to play and I love it. So what are some of the songs that you've included? Oh, well, well, no, no, je ne regrette rien. I mean, that's famous. I have no regrets. Can we say that in our lives? Yeah. We have no regrets. And, um, you know, I'm gonna love you, which is Judy Garland. And then uh, Patsy Cline. 
Well, I'm going to be singing a Patsy Cline classic, but not as Patsy for this song that I'm going to be singing. It's more Pearl Avalon, who is my southern usher in the soldiers and sailors from Warhol, and in is Patsy Cline, and I walk into the dressing room, and there's Patsy Cline standing right there in a white chiffon dress looking right at me. And it's just, you know, I just take the audience to these places, and it's fun. Oh, that is amazing. And also, not only are you taking these amazing women on, you've taken Braden on too. You're giving oh. him singing lessons. Is that right? <laughs> Has he admitted that, has no. he? I no. thought it was secret squirrel. Oh, Bertie, my ear just told me about it. He's How's he going? good. He's really good. Why don't you break him song? Oh, no. what a come beautiful on. No, no, no. morning. No, He's we're really not doing good. Come that. on, Brayden. Gordon McRae, eat your heart out okay. in Oklahoma. Well, lucky for you, we've run out of time, Brayden. Oh, hey, Ali, really? thank you so much. My pleasure. Ali Harper is in Christchurch tomorrow night with Songs for Nobodies, and then she continues to tour the country until the end of October. You can check out her website for ticket details.